First right. of all, make some noise for Matt D. Have a seat, first. Welcome, 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 Can welcome, have welcome. Right have a seat in the middle. Yes. Okay. Guest of Let's honor. Have a chat. And then yeah. we can sing some more. Welcome to Kenya. Thank you so much. I'm so happy to be here. Wow. I'm it's really happy. Quite tall. <laughs> oh, <really? laughs> First, uh, uh, let's just get something out of the way. Most people, every time we talk about Rwanda, talk about the beautiful ladies, um, now that you've been in Kenya, <clears throat> do you still believe all the beautiful ladies are in Rwanda? You know what? The first thing I noticed when I came here, they look alike. They really look alike. <laughs> I thought I was in Kigali. It's the forehead. <laughs> you guys are beautiful too. What are you talking about? So they're very beautiful. They're very beautiful. Yeah. I love Let's it. Well. Make some noise for yourselves. Sure. Yeah. We had to get that out of the way fast. Okay. So let's yeah. talk about, ab about your background a little bit. You were born in Burundi. Yeah, I was born in Burundi, and uh, I grew up in Rwanda. Uh -huh. Then I moved to the States, but now I come back and forth. Okay. Back yeah. and forth from the States to Rwanda? Yes. Okay. All right. And the music that you do is R&B music. R&B, Afrobeat. Yeah. Uh, a little bit of everything. Is R&B music popular in, in Rwanda, or what's, what's sort of the reception there? What? Yeah, uh, to be honest, it's kind of uh, how the music started back home. We all started uh, R&B, and now we're all taking it to Afrobeat. So it used to be really big. Now it's, there's a little bit of a mixture of uh, Afrobeat and R&B. Yeah. So from you, Burundi, Rwanda, the States, tell us about how, how you, you know, you... Your, your childhood, your background, and how you finally settled on uh, deep music? Uh, well, Burundi and Rwanda, they're kind of uh, almost the same. Mm -hmm. I don't know if you know. So, um, uh, after the genocide, it was, that's when like everybody kind of came together. Mm -hmm. People came from Kenya, Tanzania, Burundi, and everywhere. So they really have almost the same culture. Mm -hmm. So it's really easy to relate mm -hmm. musically. Mm -hmm. When you're in Kigali, you know, they love Kenyan music. Oh yeah, Kenyan music uh, is like really big over there. So I would say it's kind of uh, easy to win the market over there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. And for you, when did you discover that you, you know you can sing and to pursue music? I started in church. Uh, I was really young. Uh, I was singing in a choir. I was a choir boy. Mm -hmm. So <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, I would say maybe at seven, eight. Oh, okay. Yeah. And then I started doing my solo career solo. Wow. What have been some of the highlights uh, of your career so far, going back and forth between the U.S. Uh, and Rwanda and performing? This is your first time in Kenya, yeah? Yeah, this is my so first time. tell us about uh, some of your performances and, and what's been some highlights. Um, I would say my first concert was uh, when I was just done with high school. I was, I think, 18 or 17, I remember. It was my first big concert. It was actually the launch of my album. It was really big in a way that I wasn't expecting it. And it gave me like a push to to love music and keep going. I would say that was the biggest moment of my life. And uh, the other one is like when I came back from the state to Rwanda, it was after seven years without performing. And uh, people really still love my music. I was really shocked. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> All right. So where can guys uh, find your music uh, if they want to listen to it? Yeah, this is YouTube, uh, Spotify, iTunes, um, pretty much in uh, every uh, mm -hmm. social. So just search for? Medi. Medi. M-E-D-D-Y. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. And uh, tell us about why, why it is that, uh, that you're visiting Kenya now. Um, it's a long story, but uh, I'll keep it short. I've always been in love with Kenyan music. And uh, this, is <laughs> 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 this is literally my, uh, one of my biggest moments right now. Because mm -hmm. uh, as I was growing up, I, I know, you know, back in the days, um, um, before even Salty Soul came, there were Ogopa DJ. Oh, of course. You know? So uh, we were always like in touch with the music, uh, the Kenyan music. And then Salty Soul, they came, and Yashiski, all those people, they came and took over. I still love Kenyan music. So I came here in a way to also expose my music to Kenyans. Yeah. Okay, right. cool all stuff. Right. Um, I also saw somebody, you're going to be at uh, B Club. Yes, tomorrow night it's going to be at B Club, yeah. Mm -hmm. And actually, Sunday, there's a uh, barbecue uh, the video is coming to I'm going to be there too so everybody should really come mm -hmm. yeah. wait excuse me what barbecue there's a barbecue who's coming to the video okay so I, that, that's what I thought Obio. I heard and I was like wait, <laughs> wait a minute yeah. okay 
Saturday. Big up is the best to be this weekend, yeah. Saturday and Sunday. So big up, yeah. okay. So Saturday and Sunday, that's what it's going to be. Yes. Talk about the, the track that you're just about to sing. You yes. said it's called Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit, yeah. Yeah, tell us about that. That was my, uh, I would say my second gospel song. Um, it was, uh, I wrote it, uh, I think in 2010, 11. It was one of those moments um, you're going up uh, through a very hard time in your life. And it literally came as a, as a, um, something like spiritual courage, if I say that. Mm-hmm. Um, I really consider it to be like one of my biggest songs. So wherever I go, I sing the song, basically. All right, we're looking forward to, to hearing that, and we're looking forward to uh, more of you in uh, Nairobi this weekend. Sure. Uh, it's been a pleasure meeting you. You seem like just such a down-to-earth, yeah, humble guy. Cool thank guy. you. That thank is you. a cool cat. Cool cat. <laughs> oh, <man. laughs> so hopefully you'll be visiting uh, Kenya more often, and when you do, this is a place to be. Always stop by, yeah. say hi to your new fans who are singing Hello, everybody. Song. Thank you for coming. Thank you so much for coming. Thank you. All right, so I guess we're going to uh, allow you to sing that song. Uh, then, so ladies and gentlemen, one more time, make some noise for Mendy!